Hello everybody, I'm Bigatech, also known as Keegan, and welcome back to Vanilla City Skylines. We are here at what used to be the entrance to Meadow Industrial, and now is just a couple dead-end roads leading into a massive field. And what I like is that you this you can see where the industrial stuff used to be like all of this uh, this like purpley orangey browny gunk uh is where industrial used to be and this section here is where my road and interchange used to be that's how inefficient i was this whole area was taken up by road for this tiny section of industrial little bit nuts right that's that's a little bit crazy so the first thing I'm going to do is get out of cinematic mode and realize just how much crap is sort of distracting me. The next thing I'm going to do is I am going to use a roundabout to handle the majority of the traffic in this area. Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to spread Meadow Industrial out of it. At the moment, it was very closed in, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spread it out just a wee bit it's gonna sort of it's gonna oh, oh that didn't place together at all that was that was not ideal um it is going to sort of spread out on the angle and these are going to feed all of the areas right so if you want to get if you want to get to the area of middle industrial that's over here you can come in you can turn left if you wanted to exit you could in theory go this way along here up if you want to get down to here for middle industrial you go down you come into this roundabout you go down this roundabout this roundabout through and out wonderful these are all highway so in theory they should handle a large amount of traffic right you've got three lanes on the highway and then the six lanes here you can have three lanes coming off and three lanes coming in so in theory this output can handle this entire this entire highway could exit onto this road and then come onto this one and you'd be fine in theory right it's a great theory it really is so what we're then going to do is we're going to come up from underground and we're just going to connect directly in like this and then i want to redo this one because i want i want to match that little bit of a curve that's going on so we'll do something like that uh, and then realize that I have completely flipped these round. Uh, so we need to go to the road. We need to go flip. And we need to turn them around like so. And the only problem here is that it does allow people to sort of do a direct U-turn there. Which I'm not... I don't know. I'm not really fond of. So I'm almost tempted to say, actually, you know what? You know what? You guys go to... Really? Really? You, you're going to play that game with me? Fine, I'll play that game with you. Right, you guys go this way. You guys go uh, this way. And then I just need to flip this one around. Right, so that there's no way people can just pull a direct U-turn. They have to sort of actually go through the system. Right. Then, this here, this is quite a large sort of access road and i don't know why i ever turned this into uh off ramp like it should have just continued as as highway right it should have just been highway because it's 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 bigger and it handles more vehicles which is what we want so we're gonna go ahead and pull that in just there which i know is kind of like it's a bit close together but um We'll see. I don't think many cars use that one, so we should be fine. In theory. In theory, we should be fine. Right. So that really is our our way in. The only other thing that I need to, to accommodate for is the fact that over in Dumsville here, we did have a way for people to get into Dumsville without going through meadow industrial which i have now removed so what we actually need is and this this is just just my thinking just my thinking is that we pull off 
right? We pull off a highway, which is this road here. Lost it for a second. Uh, we pull this off and we go underground. And we come out along here and we, we, we essentially, and we do the same here, just have a direct kin- Really? That's, that's not it. Why would you think that's what I wanted you to do? That's very clearly not what I want you to do. Can you do it? Thank, thank you. Thank you very much. Right. Okay. So then this one, all we're going to do is we're going to go straight through with highway, mind you, with highway. And it's going to connect just here. Okay. So then we'll come up. And we'll go to there. Right? Perfect. So this is the way for people from the highway to come into Dumsville. They also, of course, have their own dedicated highway connection over this side. But if they're coming from this side, they can come in, split off straight away. And they can come in all the way over here. Which I personally think is great, right? It gives them direct access to the uh the train station here which is fine and then we'll use this road here as the connection into dumsville uh, sorry into meadow industrial itself so now that those connections are done we need to start blocking everything up now i would like the roads i don't want to block anything up because that was the issue i had last time um but what i'm thinking of doing is using six lane roads for everything and the reason i'm thinking of doing that is because a major issue that i had last time was that vehicles like uh service vehicles couldn't get around anywhere and the reason for that was because they had you know they were being blocked by a lot of terrible terrible roads so they couldn't actually get anywhere uh, so i'm hoping to remove that as an issue by this time having bigger roads throughout the place okay so as you can see i sort of had this uh is that hexagonal one two three four five six. yeah this sort of almost hexagonal shape going on with loads of roundabouts and everything and i think that that is fan diddle -tastic. now the other thing that we're going to need is the train station here is going to need a connection for itself uh and to do that i am going to get rid of this connection and i'm actually going to pull i'm, I'm going to move this okay first off i'm going to move it over there then what i'm going to do is get the get a road and the road that i want is again a, a six lane but a I'm gonna go with my with my whole like um, one way system for for the train like this, right? That that is what I'm gonna do, and then that's gonna be a one way in, and then you'll have a one way. Uh, you have a one way going like this, so you have one way in, one way out. Uh, then you have two way just there, and then this fills up. The, the rest of this two-way section here and then this will start sort of the grid uh which will go something like that and then actually i want that to come down so we'll just go ahead and get rid of that but of course i have to be cautious of this train line here uh so what i will have to do is now grab this plonk it down there and that is going to be perfect for what i want because what I'm going to do is connect these like this. And then this side is going to come up. No, don't snap. Don't snap. To, whoop. Really? Slope too steep? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess it, I guess it kind of is, isn't it? That's right. We'll do, we'll do, uh, we won't pull that out of, like un, from underground just yet. We'll go here. We'll go down. Uh, we'll come to here and then we'll do, we'll get rid of, we'll get rid of that one. And then we will, ah, oh, come on, really? Why would you let me build it then? Oh, all right. We'll go to here 
Then we'll go underground like oh, that. Lovely. All right. So now we have that train line connected back in and it's slightly further this way, which gives us slightly more room. And I realize that this is a shit connection. So I'm actually going to get rid of that. I'm also going to get rid of that. This is its own, like, this is going to have its own dedicated line, okay? And you know what? It's it's not going to be one way. It's going to be two way. I know I'm going back on what I said, but this whole thing, can you not be underground, please? Can you, can you not? Thank you. Right. This area is all going to be two way, like this. And then it will have a line that sort of goes, that, well, this is going to go straight up like that. And then that is going to connect on. Just there. Lovely. And then that's its own like little dedicated ring loop just for that. Just for the train station, okay? You get your own like dedicated little loop, which is great. Then this can come off, right? So then this is going to come down i think that's what i'll do i'll do one u down from each sort of connecting road in the middle i'll try and get that as dead center as possible and we'll go down by one u i said so we we'll just go to whoop, there uh then from the center here again we're gonna have to move these even further back spending loads of money to do so but that's fine i've got plenty of it uh, over 3 million at this point, and I'm not even making any money. Uh, that's fantastic. So we'll do that one there. Then on this side, we'll do the same thing. We'll go one, and then we'll go one, and then we'll go uh, just roughly there, and we'll go one. And that's going to connect to there. And then all of these are going to connect as well. So everything is all always going to be connected, right? So everywhere should in theory be able to get to everywhere else and there should be no like major clog ups there's loads of ways for everyone to get everywhere else we should be fine and then with areas like this we can just go ahead and sort of fill them up right we'll do something like this and we can i i can be a little bit crazy with it i'm not fussed i don't mind sort of crazier roads in fact, I kind of like them. Like, you you know me by now. I kind of like my crazy roads. So I'll do something like that. Uh, bulldoze that. Find a way to snap. Fantastic. Snap there. Get rid of that. Boom. Right. There we go. That's section one. So as you can see, Meadow Industrial is getting a massive sort of space upgrade. Like, it's going to be a lot bigger. Uh, but it's also going to be, hopefully a lot easier to maneuver around so that goes there this can go no we need hmm how can i build this so that oh just like that that is now connected to the metro right so we'll have to just do something like this from six down to four no, we'll, we'll just go straight into four lane here. So we'll just quickly grab a four lane and we'll do that. We can then get rid of that tip just there. We can get rid of that. Though actually, no, that one needs to come out by one. Uh, and then this whole section here is going to be more industrial. So we'll just go ahead and create that. So we'll do this. And then from here, we'll probably connect probably to there. And then this will come most likely across like that. Right. Okie dokie. Um, I think for now, that's probably enough space for Meadow Industrial, right? Like that, that to me seems plenty. So, the next thing that we're going to do is place down all of our, like, our power sections. And I think, I, I kind of like the idea of having... No, all of our services are going to go in that central loop just there. Uh, and I want some power. I want power on all of the outer loop sections just here. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. We'll go one there. We should have another one which can go 
there then this power plant can go next to that one this one can go next to that one and then the big whack off nuclear power plant can go out there because why not right why not then we will need a incinerator okay we're gonna have one on this side and one on this side we will need a uh we'll need two of the do we want a hospital or do we want a like i could place a hospital down here and that would reach basically everywhere right so if i i'll go ahead and place a hospital in there and then we're going to get a couple uh crematoriums over here then a big old fire station just here and in fact i'm, I'm going to do two of those because i can and then we'll only need the one police station like definitely only need one there no education though actually these guys are all educated now because of the uh the eden project or whatever one it was that i placed down that educates people so these guys are all like fully educated which is a little bit of a shame but that's that's okay so it's no longer dumbsville but it is kind of dumbsville uh so that is all of the services now in theory that metro is still linked and yes it is uh, there is still some buses going through there, so that's fine. The only thing now is to make sure that our power gets connected. So we'll go ahead and we will link that up like so. And then what I want to do is just find a way to just link all of these uh, like this, which is, it's, it's super ugly, uh, but it's sort of what I'm going to have to do for now. So I have one going into there we'll have one coming into there uh one there so this connects to this one which connects to this section which connects to this one which is those which is those and then this connects to here which connects to that one right hit play and in theory everything is now connected wonderful and we should also get a massive demand for industrial but i'm gonna end this episode there so guys thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed it if you did smash that like button also don't forget to hit subscribe and i'll see you in the next one